So lately, you know, mm -hmm. I, after being here for 20 years, I realize more and more mm -hmm. when I'm getting all these calls from families mm -hmm. and they're coming more often um, and I place many children mm -hmm. and so the age range is very different. They can be calling me around five years old or 10. Mm -hmm. I've even gotten a couple calls from kids that were 18. Yeah. And you know, the questions change, but the parents, it's always around adoption and how do I talk about this mm -hmm. as the child gets older, mm -hmm. um, how much information to share, when to share. And it's all about these parents. I think it's a, a confidence in mm -hmm. what they already know mm -hmm. and they kind of need a boost around that a little bit yeah. or the language mm -hmm. and kind of helping them to kind of circle back to, I know my kid, mm -hmm. but I need somebody to kind of help me kind of like get down that path where I can really have this conversation and it's meaningful. And families in those situations aren't really looking for in-depth counseling. What I think many of our families are looking for, similar to what you're saying, is sort of like a booster session. And for us here at Spence Shaman's Modern Family Center, we, we call that coaching. And that can mean anything from coming in for just a few sessions, um, meeting with, with one of our coaches who have decades of experience, um, thinking about families who've been formed by adoption, and really being able to meet families like, where they're at. And one of, you know, as you were talking, I was thinking one of the most wonderful phone calls that I get, and I know for you too, is when families come back that we've been part of their um, adoption experience and their families that are familiar to us through Spence and either the parents will call or sometimes even the kids will be back in touch. When parents are preparing for the adoption, we do all of this work, um, whether it's home, we call it home study or parent prep and training, right? And a lot of these ideas are, live very intellectually, right? They're just in our minds and all these things that we think um, are supposed to happen or ways we're going to parent or things that we read in books and articles and then life happens. Know, and we're involved in parenting and we're going through all of these different developmental milestones and it's real life this time and sometimes that can be a little trickier than we had imagined and it's wonderful to have the support of someone that you trust here at Spence Chapin to who remembers you who really gets that you need a little bit of extra support. What's been amazing to me is you know a lot of this has actually coalesced a little bit in the last few weeks. Mm -hmm. I, I received this graduation photo of this mm. amazing young man I placed yeah. 18 years ago. And then a couple weeks ago, I had a family bring their seven-year-old in to kind of see this the place and meet me. So I think that aspect of like seeing a seven-year-old and seeing an 18-year-old and seeing what's happened with these children mm. over this period of time has made being here so incredibly exciting and moving and mm -hmm. just kind of awesome in a way that I don't think a lot of people experience and so